we're back. Hey y'all, finally getting to hit the woods after this COVID spell. Um, we, this is the last weekend of adult. Today is, well, today's the last day of the year, December 31st. Right? Or is it? Yeah, December 31st. And uh, so it's the last day of 2021, last day of the adult season in our unit. So we just happened that Garrett, he ain't got to go. Sarah's been working, of course she was in quarantine. They both have the same day off, so we're gonna try the same plan we did with Daddy-O. So uh, we're gonna, Garrett's taking a rifle and Sarah's taking a muzzleloader. It's a little foggy, it's about 58 degrees. Not real ideal check temperatures for deer hunting, but we don't turn down a chance and we can go after them. So y'all stay tuned, hang tight. Sarah and Garrett, they're ready to roll. Yeah, baby. You hammered uh, out of him, didn't you? 
No, you got him. You nailed him. I, from the angle that he's at by the camera, I got the kill shot and everything, but the angle he's at by the camera, I, I was trying to stop him. That's why I went back, you know, just to get him to stand still. But, man, you hammered him. You did good, dude. Well, you got him. What was funny is I told Sarah, I was trying to get the camera on. I said, oh, Lord, I don't know whether to text him, turn the camera on. And then when I looked over, you was already looking at me. And I just nodded my head, and you dropped down on that gun. I thought that couldn't have worked out no better. We seen him coming out of the woods, and we was going to text you. But by the time I got the camera on and looked over at you, I didn't know it was on. <laughs> Good deal. Well, uh, that was quick. But that's been, what, you're 14 year old? So you're, how old are you now? 20, you're about to turn 25. It's been 10, 10 years. Congratulations, buddy. I can't wait to get down and we'll look at him. But we're going to wait a little bit and see if another steps out for Sarah. Ah right, man, but congratulations, big man. And a while sixty, good. <laughs> All right, we'll text you if we can't get the shot. You can put your dough down. All right, buddy. See. You. Garrett hasn't shot a deer since he was fourteen year old, thirteen or fourteen. He just moved back to Piney, and I tell you, that might not be the biggest buck that we've killed on Piney Life this year, but that right there means a lot. And him and his girlfriend are going to come process it and learn the process. they getting back to their roots. So we're going to sit back and get quiet, see if Miss Sarah can do one of them over the shoulder, uh, left hand side, muzzle load of deer like she's been doing all year. Looks like we got another deer. I can spot. Oh. Well, oh, you got your shell, didn't you? It's coming over. Huh? Well, I was wondering, I was packing up, and I thought, what are they going to do? Go find it real quick. Yeah, we got to go see if we can find this deer. Well, we just got down. It started raining pretty hard. Looks like the weather's going to pick up. So, uh, we're going to get down here and uh, let Garrett tell you story. It looks like uh, there ain't going to be no tracking job on this one. See it from here. <laughs> yeah, white belly from here on the ground. Let's see, yeah, there it is. Very good morning. Very good morning. I told you the guy on the truck, I said, we gonna see something. Even Sarah, we sitting here and Sarah said, she said, uh, I'll make a deal with you. And I said, what's that? She said, uh, that if a deer shows up at 10 o'clock, no matter what it is, I'm shooting. I said, okay, that'll work. <laughs> But it started raining before then. But anyway, let's get down here and look at this deer. Yes, it's only got one side. I thought that was him. He's a duck. Yeah. He's a duck. Dang, dude. Dude, that's... Yeah, he didn't even grow a horn. Yeah. That was, this is a deer need to go, bud. Oh, my gosh. Perfect shot, Garrett. Perfect shot. That's taught by the best. That's, you don't get no better than that. That's a good shot too. Yeah, that deer had one horn. He didn't even grow the other horn or antler. Yeah, he don't even have a spot for it. No, there ain't nothing there. I'd say that's one of Elliot. He might be broke off, I can tell it's not. Well, see, Elliot did that for years. That might be one of Elliot's boys. Probably good not take out the herd. Either way, 
it's your first freaking deer in 11 years man this and it's I don't know. And then you can see the stand. Let's see if I can get the stand on here. Stand's right there. That's an easy. That's an easy 70 yard poke. Well, <laughs> go ahead and tell the story. So, you see the stand. Uh, I didn't really have a good visual on him until he was clearly out of the woods. But, you know, I'm up there just try not to get too comfortable <laughs> kicking around. I started stretching, tried to keep myself from yawning. And about that time I looked down and he was already breaking out in the field and I looked over at you <laughs> and you said, so put the gun up there, waited for him to stop and here we are. You know, you might not have hunted as much as we had in a few years, but if you look on your hunting career, you're three of three. Yeah, <laughs> I would say, I'm Stuff in the woods we come to kill. <laughs> yeah, we usually come to kill. I know it's late season. I'm glad you got hope you get a bug on this and it gets the you get to hunt bug, we'll we'll hammer them down next year. We'll get after them. Old one old one horn wander. He'll make a cool looking Euro without that other horn. We'll Euro his skull out and you hang him on the wall. Yeah, I was thinking he was a spike. I was like, man, I can't I thought one of it was gonna be a three, but Well, I thought he was a spike too until uh until I went back and watched the video. And I, I noticed it was that we've seen this deer before. Really? Yeah. Not no, not no more. He's gonna make some good back straps. So I guess yeah. Miss Sadie gets to help us uh, work a deer up in five days. Yeah. Sure. We'll let him hang for a while. But anyway, let's go ahead and call Papa right quick. Yeah. Hello. What's up, Papa? Well, I, we just got down. Uh, you know, sat in the stand for a couple of hours, seen one shot at it, missed. So, yeah. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> got me a. I guess he's a two point, he, and he's not a spike. So. <laughs> yeah, he's missing. He's missing his right antler, but he's a two point on the left side. <laughs> Shoot ya! I say he didn't even move. We hit him, and he just fell. He just went straight down. I know, I was like, I got to, I put the gun down, I was like, well, <laughs> we don't have to work too hard today. <laughs> I jumped straight up in the air. Yeah, I just want to call and let you know I put one down. First deer in 11 years. Yeah, that's cool, buddy. I'll come over and check him out when you get back. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll holler at you when we get back. Okay, congratulations. Thank you, Papa. Love you. Love you. We might have had to set out a while. We told you that we was gonna get back after him. Uh, Garrett is his first deer in 11 years. Congratulations, dude. Thanks. Made a smoking shot, as you can tell in the video. I mean, it's, I'd say we got 70 yards, and uh, I'd say it's about 70 yards, and he, I mean, he let the hammer down. But uh, this is a real special hunt. We didn't think we was going to get back in the woods. We got hit with COVID, but we're all back healthy and out and enjoying outdoors. And on the last weekend, Garrett plugs one. So, what do you think about this, Garrett? You gonna get back in it? Oh yeah. yeah that's a good way to end the season. You think he's gonna get crazy about it, sir, like we yeah. are, and go crazy? He will. Yeah. He lives like two houses down. Yeah, since he lives two houses down, yeah, I think we can get him to the woods. He's just swing by and grab me. He's got to wake me up sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I might have to jerk him out of the bedroom with the side by side, but we'll get him out. But anyway, <laughs> we're really, uh, we're really pumped. This has been a blessed season. We've had a great season. I'm glad Garrett got on board. The whole crew, everybody got a deer this year, if not limited out. So um, this is pretty much it. We're going to have to check Sarah's schedule. Maybe we'll get another hunt in. We might get another hunt in tonight with her. Uh, this is probably it for Garrett. It closes Sunday, but uh, anyway, he he wanted to get one for the end of the year. He didn't get. He got a late start, but he got it. But we really appreciate y'all appreciate y'all watching. And if you like what we're doing, like I always ask, please subscribe and like. Drop us a comment below. And as always, we'll catch you on the next video. We might not be done yet, so we'll see you next time. God bless.